Hello my loves, welcome to my first packing video. I've been dreading this, I hate packing, I hate moving, but it's gotta happen. Um, so I am starting in the garage, um, or like my filming space. And I actually, I did a little bit of packing yesterday. I packed um, one box of like tech bits and a um, little bit of like small organizing like storage things and stuff like that the bulk of the packing that i need to do in here is my makeup and like you know other beauty products like skincare and hair care and stuff and also my makeup brushes and i i'm pretty sure that's kind of where the packing in here stops so i want to get that done today so it's off my to-do list and I no longer have to think about it. If you are finding this video and you're like oh I didn't know you were moving um go and watch my like declutter videos that I published recently. All of the questions you might have are in there but I'm not going to be answering them. Again the boxes that I'm using I just picked up a 10 pack from Officeworks they're 38 litre small moving boxes so they're um in millimeters they're 450 long 300 wide and 295 high um which i think will be okay for me because if they get too big and too heavy i'm not going to be able to lift them and move them so that's what i'm using um i'm gonna take a wild stab in the dark um i have one two three four five six chest of drawers that contain beauty products they're not all full though i'm hoping that everything will fit in no more than four boxes so let's see if i'm right and let's get to the packing I'm just realizing that I probably should pull out some extra makeup to travel with rather than the super paired back makeup bags that I have inside. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with mascara and foundation. Maybe do I want to take another face mist? Which one is the most used? Um, what have I got for brow color in my room? Oh, hang on. I need to go get my makeup bag. Okay, let's see. Is this enough to last me a month? Yes, definitely. Let's take the nude. I want to play with the nude. Rest. See you in a month, dolls. Okay. How heavy is this? Oh, it's heavy. Okay. One set of drawers done and the box isn't quite full. There's still a little bit of room in there. I've just realized you guys are probably going to want to hear the clicky clack of everything going into the boxes because we know how fucking, how good that sounds. Um, but I've been playing an episode of Ramsey's Kitchen Nightmares in the background, so there's that. Um, but I will turn that off so you guys can enjoy the dulcet tones of makeup click clacking at high speed. Maybe I should have left them in their trays and just packed the trays in there. Ugh, I didn't think about that. God damn. Mm. Oh, yeah, I agree, Freya. heavy oh this is where my nightmare begins the palettes 
I have a sneaking suspicion that I'm going to hate myself when I have to unpack these makeup boxes and I feel like I probably could have done it a bit smarter. Um, maybe standing them up would have been a bit better but whatever we're too deep now and I don't have time to really question what I'm doing. <laughs> That weighs an absolute ton and I'm trying to think if I have anything really light that can go in there um, because otherwise I'm if I put more makeup in it I'm not gonna be able to lift it and move it okay I'm just not gonna seal that one up I'll put it aside and I'll see what my options are. So far I'm happy with how much space the makeup is taking up, but I'm not done. I've got another drawer like over here. So this is my last makeup drawer, which is awesome. Then it's just like skincare, hair care and all that stuff. I'm thinking what I might start to do is potentially like not fill these boxes up completely with makeup. Um, maybe fill them or like, you know, makeup, skincare, hair care, all that jazz. Um, I might fill them up like halfway and then try to put lighter things from my bedroom in them. Yes, makeup done. Okay, here are the two makeup boxes. So you can see that this one wasn't quite full. I suspect that I may have actually been able to fit all of my makeup into two boxes because it was just the last of my large palettes and then my lip products and I reckon it would have been super close I may have had like a couple of lipsticks that had to go into another box but my big palettes and most of my bulky like the um where are they the Kaleidos lip sets they would have been able to fit in there no problem so my makeup collection, no, not calling it a collection. My makeup stash fitting across two uh, 30, what are they? 30 something liter, 38 liter boxes. Um, I'm happy with that. <laughs> and I can't wait for it to get smaller. How exciting. Um, okay, time to move on to skincare and all the rest of it. Oh God, here we go. I've decided to pull out some of these small PR boxes that I had kicking around for little things like, you know, lip balms and stuff like that. Because this sort of crap, while it's like, they're small, but don't be deceived, this tub is heavy. I don't want to damage my back when I'm trying to move this stuff, so um, I'm going to try to be a bit more strategic about what I'm doing. Oh, these can go in one of those boxes that's almost full. I had so many more of these little boxes that I'm using from PR. Man, I wish I'd kept them. <laughs> Okay, I've only got three more drawers to deal with here. So let's do it. Oh, okay, that drawer's done. You know what would have been smart? If I'd thought to put all of these lipsticks and like 
eyeliners and stuff like that that are in that box um, into makeup bags before I pack them. Oh, look at these nails, my God. Um, that would have been really smart, but my brain is not here today. It's checked out weeks ago. The boxes are getting heavy and they're not quite full. I wish I bought smaller boxes, whatever. Let's just keep going. I will find stuff to put in here. Hopefully it will be light stuff. I can't waste space. <laughs> I'll probably regret this, but I am going to fit the last of this stuff into this last box. That will make like, I think five makeup boxes and some little ones, or like makeup and beauty products. Um, this one is already pretty heavy, but I just need it to be done. I think there needs to be another brush cull, uh, but that'll have to wait until after I've moved. Okay, Freya is keeping guard of the boxes. So, um, this is what I have so far. There are six boxes, so it's like two boxes deep and three high. I've got these little ones on top. That consists of all of my beauty products, um, my like office bits and bobs, and some stuff from my bedroom, which I managed to fit in the boxes as well, which is awesome. Um, some of them I did just put shoes on top, um, just wrap the shoes up and put them on top because they're really bulky, but they're really light. So that was a really good way to fill that space without making the boxes like so much heavier. I've got a tub of stuff I have to take inside and sort out. There was also like, I decluttered some makeup brushes and stuff like that. I've got a pile of crap here that I need to deal with and I need to also deal with this stuff. These things I want to pack. I might take one of these to like put brushes in or something, but also I might not. Other than my lights and my camera and my tripod and or tripods um, and stuff like that, I don't have anything else in this room that I need to pack, which is which is fantastic. I have three more of those packing boxes left and I've got one that's half full in my bedroom. So that is actually what I'm going to limit myself to when it comes to packing stuff in my bedroom. Now, um, I am going to put my bags in vacuum seal bags, uh, put my bags in vacuum seal bags. Wow. The brain is gone guys. Like. I'm not kidding when I say it's completely checked out. Um, I have vacuum seal bags, which I'm going to put my clothing in to make it more compact. So I'm pretty hopeful that those three and a half or four boxes that I've got left over will be plenty for packing what's in my room. But that will be in the next video, I think. I think this one will go up first. I don't no, if it goes up second then I don't know but anyway um so I'm gonna go thank you guys for hanging out with me while I packed my crap um this just makes me want to use up 
more of my beauty products. Um, and I will not lie, there was a few minutes there where I was like, do I just bin this all and start again? But I can't afford to do that and move. So no, I opted not to. I'm sure it'll all fit in the car. I was gonna say, I hope it all fits in the car, but I'm sure it will. I've got the boot and the back seat, so. Anyway, I'm gonna go guys. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.